Have you seen my tools? Oh, never mind. Just spotted them. Come on in. Everyone is welcome, so long as they don't cause any trouble. I could really go for a hoagie. Uh, sandwich. I'm getting sick of potatoes. I know they're easy to grow, but... I take it you talk to Paige. Variety. I did and I do, yep. Yeah. But there's something we need to take care of first. It'll be worth it. So, okay. Hilariously, I'm looking for something that is designed to be invisible. Huh. Untraceable. It's a suit that hides you from everything, even laser detection grids. Which would help out with Vault 79, right? Yes, exactly. This tech allowed for other tech from the same origin to see it and report back. If the wearer wasn't where they were supposed to be... Bang! Right? Yeah, so we just have to get that other tech, which is easy to find by comparison, and check its logs. Which means that we need to go out and grab one of those jumpy little liberator bots. Yeah, that untraceable spy tech? It's Chinese. Liberators like to gossip, speaking in lay terms. They ping each other whenever they see something interesting. It's actually kind of a design flaw. All right. I'll see if we have anyone around here who can help out with the next part. Wow, existential. For a perfectly preserved slice of pie, maybe? I'd kill someone for a great slice of pie, full disclosure. If you help me find the robot, we can find a spy suit, and then I can wear the spy suit for the vault job. Got it? Oh, well, my parents both used to take me along when they went scavenging. They were really good at it, so I picked up some good pointers. So I guess I've been doing this most of my life. I guess a lot of people born after the war and outside of the vaults could say the same. I feel like I recognize that name. Is she good with robots? I can do electrical stuff, but hacking and whatnot is beyond me. Excellent! Thank you for the heads up. I was just going to read Paige's diary to find out who to talk to. Be safe out there. Paige might seem like a real stick in the mud sometimes, but he's held this group together through a lot of hardship. I can't believe I lost my Nuka Tapper saves. Ugh. Civilization is being rebuilt right here in Foundation. Hmm. 
I suppose your conversation with those two seemed on the up and up, though I'd still be cautious of the rest out there. Now, was there something you required of me? Do be careful out there, Mum. know you. I've heard some amazing stories about you. I could really go for a hoagie. Uh, sandwich. I see you found a way to get into the vault. Thanks again for lending a hand. Oh, you're quite welcome. Ah, hello again. Put that robot on my workbench, will you? I'll be honest. I was hoping you'd have the mother load just hanging around in your room, Penny. Oh no, there's no room for that. Though knowing her, she may yet try to make an appearance. <laughs> so do you want the logs from this robot? Yep. Always Look for an entry that begins with 58 somewhere. when you're in. That should list any entries related to our target. These logs look encoded, but like nothing I've seen before. I see the numerical headers you mentioned, though. The entry you're looking for would have been broadcast daily since about 11 years ago. Just read the stuff in brackets at the end when you find it. Found it. The part in the brackets says BAI2. Q U A N two, Y U A N two, and then the number seven. I'm afraid that's all Chinese to me. As in, it's actually Chinese to everyone. I Yuan Quan, Y U. Uh oh, White Spring. Why seven though? Hmm. Oh. Seventh hole on the golf course, maybe. Wait, you don't... do you? What, speak Chinese? I mean, it's been a while, but yeah. Wait, so my mom's last known location was... a golf course? I don't get it. I can't imagine there's anything spy-worthy there. What the heck long. would she be doing there? Are you saying what I think you're saying? <sighs> yes, they were spies. My parents were spies. They're both dead, all right? I was born here. I don't know about any of that. No, no, no. I don't care about. I mean, you're looking for... spy gadgets? That's like a dream project. Can I see everything I when you get back? Rest my eyes for uh... That's all. Sure? That'd be great, actually. It had this biometric encoding, and I think it'll work for a close relative like me. But, um... Let, let's talk later. You said you're recalibrating the robot. To do what, exactly? To find the tech if it's still nearby, and not shoot at anyone along the way. Maybe if you take it to the seventh hole, it'll pick up the signal again. I'll get the lab ready for when you get back. Be safe out there, you two.
Wow, I feel like we're actually finally going to find it after talking to Penny. I've never been this close. So, you ready to go? Never mind. Really? Where was I? All right. But before I go, I should probably talk to Paige. I can catch up with you later, but I want to be the one to tell him about my folks. Sounds like a plan. Oh, don't forget our little recalibrated friend here. I get that some of the folks here are really afraid of the Scorch Bees, but for me, it's the giant ugly toads. Ugh! Should have built that house long ago. Party started. Oh, Penny showed me how to send a transmission to your Pip-Boy directly. In case you didn't know why you're hearing my voice then. I'm not a ghost, I swear. It looks like the Liberator is homing in on the last known location of the tech now. Which I guess I don't need to tell you, since you're probably watching the little things scoot around right now. Unless you left it all alone in the world to loot something. I'd understand if you did. Robots are slow. Oh, I talked to Paige, and we're all good here. He gets that we don't pick our parents. Stuff was always hard with them. It's been better with the Foundation crew. Whoa! Hey! Lots of new signal contacts. Are you coming up on Beijing or something? I'm getting suited up now. I'll head out as soon as I can. Just try to be careful out there, okay? Hey, Penny here. Looks like your little robot buddy blew up. Oh, well, you must have really given it a good conk when you found it. Usually, these little guys stick their landings a lot better. Jen's already out the door, but it'll probably take her a while to make it over to you there, wherever you are, somewhere below the green. You should look around. You're never know what you might find. Bring back a souvenir for your best buddy, Penny, won't you?
Don't. I don't want to fight. I don't want any trouble. I'm here against my will. Yes, I can see why that would be confusing. Not all of us have the luxury of choice. They threatened to kill my family if I didn't work for them. From what I have overheard on these listening devices, you are working with my daughter. She's on her way here, right now. I didn't want her to have to witness the inevitable. But here we are. This ends the same either way. She shouldn't be long now, based on the proximity warnings on that console. Hey, there you are. I'm here. I caught up. Ma? Wait, how can you be alive, Mom? Why are you here? What is this place? Jen, why would you come here, you foolish child? You need to leave. We came here looking for your corpse. I needed a suit, but I buried Dad with his years ago. I couldn't get it off. He was killed in it. I didn't know you were alive down here. How could I? You left. Just don't move, okay? I, I'm trying to think of a I way to I don't have anything more this. to say to you. We're, we don't just kill you along with everyone else down here. I don't have anything more to say to you. This is... I can't believe what's happening. I was certain that they killed her, but here she is, working for them? It's too much to consider. How can someone do that to their own child, though? How do you just leave them to make their own way in this world? It's asking a lot for me to forgive her. I think I can do that. Mom, what do you say? What if I can help you hide out? We can make it work, can't we? So, how does this work? How can we save you? Let's figure this out. I'll have to go into hiding and destroy the suit. They're tracking it. We might be able to shield the signal from the suit once or twice. But are you willing to give it up after using it? We don't have much time to decide. You're probably right. I don't want anyone to be in danger because of it, but I trust both Penny and yourself to find a way. I'll finish up here and then meet you back at Foundation, okay? I need a moment. I'll meet you back at Foundation.
Oh, I'm sore all over. Hey, I got the suit. Looks like we're good to go. She's gonna meet up with me after we hit Vault 79. I need to tell Paige about the risk before she comes here. I want to be better about being honest. It's hard to tell the truth when you're afraid of getting hurt. But you and Paige have really helped me out when you didn't have to. It's taught me to trust. A bit. You don't happen to have a piece of Derek's blackberry pie, do you? I bet. <laughs> now, nah, I'm good. Sorry. Bad joke. I'm all good to go. <laughs> nah, it wasn't too badly broken. I snagged it on my way out. Penny's gonna fix it up so it can chase the cat around. Sounds good. And hey, thanks again. Those Mothman cultists give me the creeps. They're all just crazy. So I saw Jin and Penny are working on that stealth tech. Guess it's time we talked about those laser turrets, huh? The blueprints don't exactly list the spec sheet, but there's a lot of install ports and wide open space. Penny started calling it the Grim Reaper's Hallway. I had to reach out to some specialists who've been shadowing us since the pit. They've agreed to meet, but they want to talk to you first. Offshoot of the Raiders. They don't get along with the Crater Group. I don't know. Something about mission protocols. They seem like ex-military to me, but I haven't exactly checked their records. Just be careful. All right. Just so you know, these people are, uh, rigid when it comes to how they contact each other. They have this whole signaling thing they do. I'm gonna mark a spot on your map. Go there and wave the flag. The old stars and stripes. That'll let them know you're the one. They'll tell yeah. you what to do from there. They keep their distance, but they've always helped us out when we've needed them. It'll work. Finally, a nice day. 